Hi guys! Happy Friday! It's Flamingo Friday! Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. It's pretty quiet this morning. Brad and Scarlett are just chilling in the pond. That's the doves serenade us. For you guys who watch the webcam at keywestbutterfly.com, there is a wedding today and tomorrow. And then um, Hernan and Bonnie, who work here, they're doing their vow renewal next Saturday. So Friday, Saturday, this week, Saturday, next week. Hi. Hi, buddy. That's right. Happy Earth Day, everybody. Flamingo Friday and Earth Day on the same day. Good day. Hey Scarlett, are you showing people how you filter feed? on the wild side. <laughs> it just cracks me up how it doesn't seem to bother him when Rhett is kicking the water like that. Casper's still hanging out, just like, nope, I'm here. You do you, but I'm not moving.
happy to hang out over here today. How was the parade? I did not attend the parade because it was past my bedtime, but um, Lisa and George said it was awesome. They were expecting, well George said he was expecting just a little parade, like the usual Key West parade where you just, we have a parade for everything. And it turned out to be really, really big and well attended. If the weather holds out and they have it, we will go on field trip to the Conquer Public battle tonight. It's pretty windy, so there was talk of them possibly not having it because of small craft advisory, but if it happens, we'll be there. Are we doing field trip tonight or tomorrow? We will be doing it tonight if they hold the battle down on Mallory Square. Um, if something happens that they don't have that because of the wind, then we'll do one tomorrow as we're driving up the Keys. We're going all the way to Marathon tomorrow, so we'll have a driving field trip. What's the parade? What was the parade for? Um, this week is Conquer Public Independence Days. Back in the 80s, the Key West withdrew from the United States for a few hours. And this week, every year, we celebrate that independence. Conquer Public Independence Days. It's a very interesting story. Um, no, we're going to Marathon, Florida tomorrow. Um, it's, it's a very interesting story. If you guys want to know any of the history of QS, just Google the Conquer Public Independence. There's some funny, wild stories. Hey, Scarlett, thanks for coming out. performance today, Scarlett. The bowing and the stretching. Red stretching.
Can I come over here? You hear Wendy's coming with the shrimp cart. And there's a rat. Hello, buddy. interest in nest building recently. There's another perfect morpho. Hey Rhett, you hang out right there. It's Flamingo Friday, but look at that beautiful morpho. Supervise her non. Yep, Brett's gotta make sure everything's good. Did Rhett get taller? No. But he has exceptional posture. How can we tell the flamingos apart? Rhett is six inches taller than Scarlet. The wingspan of the average Morpho is probably about three inches. There's some really big ones flying in here right now. There's some over there right there doing that dance. They're probably more like four and a half inches across. This Julie is putting on quite a performance eating his breakfast. See that nectar that was on his proboscis? King of the pond, buddy. You're king of the pond. Don't tell Casper. are typically always in flight. It's a little cool for them, so we get them to pose in our photography.
that happening a lot again? I guess we're gonna have a pretty chill flamingo Friday. Just hanging out in the pond being flamingos. Thank you guys for walking with me. Hope you guys have a great day. Remember, if you want to check out the wedding tonight, it's at, on the webcam at keywestbutterfly.com and it should be around 5 o'clock. And I'll see you guys for slow motion Saturday and some kind of field trip, either tonight or tomorrow or both. I'll try to give a 30 minute warning. Hope you guys have a great day. Great weekend. Thank you for everything.